So kind of starting around middle school, I kind of started learning that life isn't easy and that it kind of gets hard sometimes. And I kind of started thinking that maybe my life was just really unlucky. You know, I had a few things happen that just happened. So after talking to my dad about this, he, uh, he told me a quote that kind of stuck with me. He told me that luck does not exist. Luck is when opportunity meets preparation. He gave me some examples like uh, studying for a test. You know, if you go up to a test and you prepare for it, you're given this opportunity to succeed. And if you study hard, you're not lucky that you pass, you work for that. And same with like a job interview. If you have this opportunity to start a career, start your life in this job, and you have a good resume, dress well, prepare, have some confidence, you will succeed in that. And it's not due to luck, it's due to your own ability. And obviously, I don't believe that luck isn't completely exist. Like if you show up to a test, Christmas tree, the entire thing, get 100, that is luck. I'm sorry. <laughs> but. <laughs> But I think luck is thrown around a lot too, more far too often as like an excuse to act humble or shift the blame away from yourself. I think people just like say that they, oh, I just got lucky just to kind of not acknowledge that they accomplished something and they should. And they also kind of see luck as like, you know, they should have done something, they should have stepped up to an opportunity, but they just said they're unlucky and they're not willing to accept that blame. And I think the issue is that we're incapable unca of seeing success within ourselves without some kind of luck coming in and according to Dr. Joe Rubino, 85% of the world suffers with low self-esteem and I, that's definitely a problem. You know, they believe that their lives can only somehow have an opportunity that hits them with a bit, well, whew, that was bad. <laughs> they believe their lives can only be successful if someone who has an opportunity that walks up and hits them in the face with a bat. You gotta go out and go get that opportunity. Once you find it, you gotta prepare for it. And in order to succeed, you have, you have to have both. You can't have you can't prepare for something if there's no opportunity. You can't have an opportunity if you don't prepare for it. You can't succeed. Like for example, when I was growing up, I always wanted to be a rally car driver. Right? That was my goal. Driving on dirt roads, car with way too much horsepower, that sounds awesome. I would still love to do it. The only problem was I drive a Chevy Evo. Alright, now, when it rained, I did drive down Proctor Road, and I had some fun. I have plenty of pictures of it covered in mud, but that's not practice, that's not enough practice. In order, and I'm, you know, when I started taking it seriously, like actually wanting to do it, I looked up like ways, how can I get started with this? And you have to have a lot of money, be willing to have a car that's suitable for this, pay for the repairs, have this practice. I didn't have any of that. Right? I was willing to prepare for it, but I didn't have the opportunity. And, here I am, becoming a mechanical engineer. Right? And same with preparation. Right? I applied to the University of Florida. I had that opportunity to go there. I did not prepare well enough in high school. Here I am in Santa Fe. I, <laughs> if I could go back and choose between UF and Santa Fe, I would still pick Santa Fe, just for the record. But I'm not saying that luck doesn't exist entirely, but Luck is used so much as an excuse for people to just, that they don't believe in their own potential or capabilities. People can't see their potential or trust that they don't have the potential. It is, it is really unfortunate that we're wired to look down on our lives and believe that we have to rely on a lucky situa situation to be successful. People could see the potential they had from someone else's eye. They could believe they could change the world. Luck does exist, yes, but we would, would you turn down an opportunity or choose not to prepare for it? and leave it the chance if you knew you could do it yourself. Thank you. Great job. There you go. Great.